I hope you guys are all having an awesome day. Easy Auto Fix here, and today we're gonna learn symptoms of a bad EVAP canister. It's part of the EVAP system. Some people call it a vapor canister or a charcoal canister. The purpose of the charcoal canister is to store gasoline vapors that are created in the fuel tank. These fuel vapors will end up being transferred to the engine where they get burned depending on when the ECM commands the purge valve to open. This reduces emissions and increases miles per gallon. If you have a diesel engine, you won't have one since the diesel fuel is not as volatile as gasoline. The location of the charcoal canister will usually be underneath the vehicle near the fuel tank. In some situations, I've seen it in the engine compartment, underneath the master cylinder, or in front of the coolant reservoir. The first symptom of a bad charcoal canister is having a check engine light on. Now there's not a direct code that detects a bad charcoal canister, but there's some codes that can lead you towards the right direction. Here's some codes that can pop up if your canister's cracked or clogged. The second symptom is the gas pump keeps shutting off while fueling. You're putting gas in your car and with just one or two dollars it clicks and turns off as if it was a full tank. This can happen if the canister is clogged, increasing fuel vapor pressure which is why your pump keeps shutting off. The third symptom is a failed emissions test. If you have a leak or a clog in the EVAP system, the fuel tank pressure sensor will read the pressure difference and the ECM will illuminate the check engine light. Having the light on will automatically fail your emissions test. The fourth symptom is noticing a fuel smell. You could experience this if the charcoal canister is cracked or damaged. If it is, the trapped gasoline vapors will escape to the outside, which is why you're noticing a fuel smell. Nice! Thank you guys for watching, make sure to like and subscribe so I can see you in the next one.